counting in Mali's presidential poll got underway on Sunday evening in an election to determine whether President Ibrahim Boubacar Keita will win a second term. It's been carried out amid increasing ethnic and jihadist violence, which has worsened since Keita came to power five years ago. There are 23 other presidential candidates, including Samela Sisse, who faced him in a runoff in the last election. Eight million people are eligible to vote in the election, and a candidate must get more than 50% of the vote to win. Voting was briefly suspended at a polling station in a village in the northern region of Kidal after militants fired about 10 mortar bombs. In some places, the lack of security meant that the vote didn't happen, and a European Union observer mission urged the government to publish a list. Yes. This is important for us as far as transparency is concerned because for us transparency, traceability and above all integrity in this election is a priority. Although Mali's economy has been growing under Keita and key exports of gold and cotton have flourished, the insecurity has taken the shine off.